Well, we knew her when is the sentiment of the Baldwin Long Island community. This little girl who grew up among them is now on her way to outer space. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan tells us the decorated astronaut will be commanding the SpaceX Crew 7 mission to the International Space Station. Am I going to be the first woman to step on the moon? The answer is I don't know. The moon, Mars, the sky is no longer the limit for the honored alumna of Lenox Elementary in Baldwin. I'm so happy that I got to meet, meet a real astronaut from this school. Again, I don't know if anyone slept. It was like the day before Lieutenant Colonel Jasmine is coming to Lenox. Less than 30 years ago, Lieutenant Colonel Jasmine McBelly was immersed in learning here at Lenox Elementary, followed by elite universities in Boston and California. Flew 150 combat missions, graduated from the selective NASA astronaut school, and soon outer space. I think one of the coolest things I'm excited about is weightlessness and floating. McBelly inspired her school community with a crash course on rocket design. Thrust, force, pull. How there's no gravity. How the space station moves 16 times a day. It was here at Lenox Elementary. McBelly first dreamed of being a space explorer, wrote a book report about the first woman in space, delivered it to the class wearing a homemade space suit. It's really wonderful to see her coming back here where her dream started and talking to the kids the same age as she was. The family fled Iran in the 1980s, came to America knowing no one. The welcoming from Baldwin allowed Mugbelli to reach for the star, she said. Her liftoff from the Kennedy Space Center is slated for August. It'll be to the International Space Station for six months. I'll be the commander of the Crew 7 mission. Maybe Jasmine Obel Mobelli one. One day is going to be on the moon and I really would like to enjoy being on the moon too. I still wake up and go, I can't believe that I'm actually a NASA astronaut. Everything you all do matters and it matters right now. Aim high, she says. In Baldwin, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News. Man, how cool is that? How often do you get to meet an astronaut? <laughs> an actual rocket scientist. Right? You know how I we mean, say it isn't rocket science. Oh, my goodness. It is. What an honor. Pretty cool. All right, let's talk about this weather. Red alert coming our way, Lonnie. Kind of tricky forecast, too. It's a very tricky one. It depends on where you live. I think some people in our area, guys, will get slammed. I and mean, this is going to be a big storm for you folks. I think other folks will not get those big effects. So elevation has a lot to do with it. The farther north you go has a lot to do with it. Currently, New York City has been kind of a dreary day all day long. And we do have rain falling out there right now. It's wet. It's not white. It's 41 degrees.